It's a school day, and we all know what that means in the McCann household. The daily battle to get Sunday dressed continues. Right, are you going to get dressed? Mm. Not yet. Thought she might say that. Okay. The battle with the clothes, I just feel like I am never going to win. It is relentless. Right, uniform time. One, two, three. Yeah, that Sunday. still looks like it's a long way off. But I am definitely seeing some progress with the Good Girl sticker chart. We're getting a decent amount of stickers now for a good girl behaviour. Don't get a big head, but I do think it is your influence being here. You think? Yeah, I do. But you're also happier and less stressed. Yeah. And they feed on I've you. Noticed, I've noticed that. What I've seen the change. In yeah, me? Both of you. Yeah. I've, I've, I have too. In me? Yeah. I'm still working on getting her dressed, but I have something up my sleeve that might help. Who's going to get dressed in their uniform this morning? Put your hands up if you've got new leggings without pockets. OK, looking good so far. I know this sounds extreme, but I've had her school uniform altered. So gone are the pockets that bothered her so much. Just fingers crossed this actually works. Leggings. The leggings. Leggings, leggings are all soft now, aren't they? Leggings. You get your jumper on. No. She's dressed. She'll definitely be getting a sticker this morning right. then. We are en route to our fabulous shoe. You're feeling a little bit nervous, not gonna lie. Not for me, it's more for... Now let's crack on with the shoe. <laughs> Success. She's in her first outfit. Things are really looking good. I am in a state of shock. She has never behaved like this on a shoe ever before. We're going to get her a new agent. She can take 10%. Not one, not two, but three looks. I cannot tell you how much of a big deal this is. Is that a wrap, guys? Sunday's the star of the show. What's your pirate name there? What's my pirate name? Mummy pirate, here you go. Sword. To the beach? Yes. Where is the coconut? Where do you think it might be? There's the cross. I can't see where it's gone. I can't see where it's it... in the back. What? <laughs> where? It's so nice to have quality time with her. Just where time stands still. Like no work, no distractions. Ultimately, Sunday, I mean, an empty coconut shell and a couple of sticks. That's all she needs. And her mother's love. It is the best to see Sunday enjoying herself. She's just so free and using her imagination and she's just got the biggest smile on her face. Are you having a nice holiday? Yeah! <laughs> I think it is really important to have conversations with your children and just see where their heads are. And there is one question that I have been dying to ask her. Sunday, do you like Loza? Oh, that is music to my ears. It is so important that Sunday's happy because ultimately that is all that matters. Aww. Oh, I love you, dude. <laughs> Today is Mother's Day, so Laurie's helping Sunday prepare a special breakfast for Fern. Right, you gonna shake this? Yeah. We need to make this breakfast very special for your mummy because she always looks after us and makes us breakfast, doesn't she? Right, this one's almost done. Maybe not. <laughs> Sunday, we've got a little bit of a problem. We'll have to decorate it nicely, yeah? Should we put a little bit of chocolate on it? Yeah, she right. likes chocolate. Rub it along there nicely. A little bit. That's it, yeah, just a little bit. Whoa. All over it. Yeah, at least it looks like the four-year-old made it. 
We've got Sundays made for you. Look at that! Wow! That was made by yours truly. Wasn't oh it? my goodness, can I have a kiss? This is such a big deal for me. Being a single parent, you miss out on moments like this. So this is an absolute first and it feels so special. That was the yummiest pancake ever. I love you so much. Right, let's go get ready. Going to the spa. Hello, oh, you okay? Yeah. I'm going to be your therapist today. Amazing. Who's going to go first with their treatments? Mm. You've been doing too much running, getting them K's in, haven't you, babes? Unlike you, eh? Jill McCann is quite the masseuse. She's a sports therapist, babes. Did you know that? What do you want to do for work when you grow up? Write. You want to write? Oh, my God. She's going to be a budding author. And it's not just Carl Fern's hoping we'll be open-minded today as she's talking to Sunday about Laurie potentially moving in. Team together. I have put a lot of thought into Laurie moving in with us. My friends and family are all on board, but the most important person that I need to check in with is Sunday. I need to make sure that she is totally comfortable with the idea. Should we do more tricks on Loza? <sighs> yeah? When Loz is here, what more tricks can we play on him? I know, hide and seek. You can play hide and seek monsters with him. With me too. With me too, would you like that? Do you like it when he stays? I really want Sunday to be on board and comfortable with the idea of Laurie moving in because if she doesn't agree, it changes everything. So, Laurie, He's going to come live with us, yeah? All the time. All the time? Do you want that? Yeah? And he can play with you and me. He can play with us. He's really good at puzzles. So you could do puzzles with him all the time. That is music to my ears. Everything is falling into place and I am so excited for this next chapter for us. Do you want lots of yummy fruit? Yeah. You do? Can I have a big cup? And a snack. You know that fruit is a snack? Yeah. Hey. Let's go, 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 go. Meeting Laurie, introducing him to Sunday, like it does change the dynamics between me and Sunday, so I had to play it right. Especially with like past experiences, she's always been a little bit wary of guys. What is that, George or Pepe's George, all right? Where's George's head? Where's the rest of Mummy Pig? Like at the end of the day, it's a really big deal for my friends and family to love him. Like that's what I've always wanted. But the most important thing is that Sunday likes him because. She's my priority, and if she doesn't like him, it, it changes everything. Oh, you're sharing. That's sweet. Why don't you do Laurie's hair? Yeah. Can we go into Sunday salon? Yes, sir. Why me? Ah. Ah. Oh. That's gorgeous, Laurie. Oh, wow. Oh, that's lovely. That's a nice one. This is the first guy that I've dated who is also a parent, which is so refreshing. Like, he just engages with Sunday more and really understands the importance of nurturing his relationship with her. No, my name's Aurelia. <laughs> OK, Aurelia. Can I sit in the back like a princess? Yes. Thank you very much. God, I can't. God has answered my prayers. Like, I'm not just saying this, but this is a massive deal for Sunday. And I was really kind of like worried and concerned. They get on really well. I know I was only away for the weekend, but I am so excited to see my baby girl. I can't wait to squeeze her little face. Did you have the best day at school? Did you? Tell me, what did you? What did you get your sticker for? For, for doing my picture. What picture did you do, darling? Mammy. So proud of you. 
So we get in, darling. We're going to do letter of the week. So after M, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, H, I, K, L, L, M, N. So we've got to find, we've got to find things begin with N. Don't forget the snack for we would you like for a snacky poo poos? <laughs> we have got Sunday's after school routine nailed. We get in, she gets changed, she has a snack, and then we do her homework. Sunday likes to get changed as soon as she walks through the door out the uniform because she doesn't just get changed into like leggings and a t shirt, it's like a full blown party dress. Good day. Hi! We're gonna do letter of the week, which is n, 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 n. We need to get this homework done because I've got Carl coming over for dinner tonight. I can't actually think. N, n, nutrition. Do you know what nutrition means? What are healthy foods? Mmm. Yes. Yes. I know I sound really biased, but. My girls are genius. This is where it gets complicated. N n knife, but it's kn. Right, babes. Knife. N n knife, but silent K. No. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. Ah! No, darling. Time's get up now. Mornings are definitely a little more intense now. Sundays at school. Oh my god, I literally can't believe the time. It's so stressful. When she was at nursery, I could drop her off in her PJs. She could have breakfast there if she wanted to. But at school, you just can't do that. She's a sleepy girl. What do you want? Shredded wheat? No. No? Quickly pick, baby, because we've not really got much time. Porridge. Chocolate. Chocolate porridge, right. Since Sunday has started school, her behaviour has come on leaps and bounds. Obviously, she still has her occasional moments, today being one of them, but that's normal, right? Well, if you wanted a bowl of honey, you should have just said, but that is not a normal breakfast. Sorry to say, you don't just eat honey by itself, unless you're a bear. Are you a bear? I find that she plays up more in the mornings when she's tired and she just finds it harder to communicate. But I don't want to be kicked, thank you very much. I think the fact that I have been practicing my conscious parenting with distracting her rather than reacting to her tantrums has really helped. We don't hit, we don't smack, we can feel frustrated. That's okay, but we don't smack, do we, darling? <laughs> Things just don't seem to escalate like they used to. Right, Sunday? You're gonna eat all your porridge up. We're gonna go to school and have the best day ever. If I've literally got to spoon feed her, pander to her, do silly voices just to get out the door on time, 